Have you ever wondered how plants drink water? It has to do with osmotic pressure allowing water from their surroundings to pass through cell membranes and into the plant. Sausage casing can be used as a semi-permeable membrane. Water can pass through it when a pressure is applied, but sugar and other large molecules cannot. In the left beaker, a sausage casing is acting as a semi-permeable membrane with a sugar solution outside and a pure water solution inside. In the right beaker, the sausage casing is again a semi-permeable membrane with the pure water inside and outside of the membrane. Red or green food coloring was added in both cases so you can better see the membrane. If the osmotic pressure inside the membrane is the same as outside the membrane, the system is isotonic and no water will move across the membrane. Over the course of a few hours, the amount of water in the sausage casing in the green isotonic setup has not changed. On the other hand, the amount of water in the sausage casing in the red non-isotonic setup has decreased. Why is this? Here, the container filled with blue balloons represents a container filled with water. The boundary between the two containers represents a semi-permeable membrane that water can freely move through. Sugar, represented by the red balloons, cannot move through the membrane. When we add sugar, the concentration of blue balloons on that side of the container goes down. There is an osmotic pressure created by the concentration difference between the two sides. To adjust for this, water from the other side moves over to the side with the sugar. Movement stops when the additional pressure created by the height change of the water balances out the osmotic pressure. This is why the amount of fluid in the sausage casing increased in the beaker that had sugar outside the sausage casing and pure water on the inside, but didn't in the system with pure water in the beaker and in the sausage casing. Going back to our question about how plants and trees take up water, when you water your plants, you increase the concentration of water in the dirt right around the plant's roots. This creates osmotic pressure responsible for forcing water into the roots of the plant and allowing the plant to take water from the dirt, creating beautiful plants such as these. Mm -hmm.